New this morning, the holiday weekend ended violently for some, and now police are investigating several shootings. Lindsay Shively is live in the Breaking News Center with more. Good morning, Lindsay. Good morning, Curtis. Yeah, the latest string of shootings happened just hours apart, and now a child is critically injured. But first, about 3 o'clock this morning, the victims of a shooting showed up at Research Medical Center. Police say this shooting happened at 93rd and Newton. Both victims suffered minor injuries. But around 10 o'clock last night, another shooting, this one at 55th and Paseo. These victims showed up at Research Medical Center as well. Six people were riding around in a car. One of them is in critical condition, shot in the head. The other victim, a woman driving the car, suffered minor injuries. Now, an update to breaking news. We first brought you at 10. An 11 year old girl is in critical condition after being shot in the neck at 43rd and Pittman around 9 15 last night. It happened in her own backyard just east of the Truman Sports Complex. Rescue crews found the girl there with no pulse. Police believe moments before she had been celebrating 4th of July with her family. Well, she was just standing in her backyard, what we have, what we know right now, and uh, somebody saw her collapse and walked up, and I, I assume that they were doing fireworks like everybody else, and they uh, just drew the conclusion that she got injured from a firework. But uh, when we showed up, it, it was clear that it, it was an apparent gunshot wound. So again, family and rescue crews first thinking this little girl collapsed because she had been hit by a firework or firecracker of some kind. When rescue crews investigated further, they discovered a bullet in her neck. Shootings have injured more than 10 people since the start of this weekend. Police were asking if you know anything to call the TIPS hotline. That's 874-TIPS. From the Breaking News Center, Lindsay Shively, NBC Action News Today. Lindsay, thank you.